भूषण जोशी आई एम कंसल्टंट न्यूरोलॉजिस्ट प्रैक्टिसिंग एट मणिपाल हॉस्पिटल खेराटी दिस इज अटेम्प्ट रिगार्डिंग क्रिएटिंग अवेयरनेस अबाउट एपिलेप्सी एपिलेप्सी इज अ डिसीज वेर पेशेंट गेट्स सीजर्स सीजर्स इन कॉमन वर्नेक्टर लैंग्वेज इज ऑल्सो कॉल्ड एज फेट्स मिर्गी अकड़ी झटका सो वॉट आर सीजर्स सीजर्स आर एबनॉर्मल एक्सेसिव इलेक्ट्रिकल एक्टिविटी ऑफ ब्रेन leading to abnormal body movements with loss of consciousness patient don't remember any of the episode happening with him he loses his consciousness and he may fall leading to accident so these are seizures and this is in which you get those seizures is epilepsy now when patient of uh, epilepsy come to a doctor we usually ask for two ma- major investigation first is mri of brain which will show me structure of your brain if there is any swelling infection trauma injury bleeding inside the brain may cause seizure second investigation we usually ask is eeg eeg is like ecg records electrical activity of your brain that will give me any clues regarding abnormal ongoing electricity electrical activity happening inside the brain apart from that there are some basic investigation which are carried out how to treat this uh, disease we treat this with very good number of medications without much of the side effects we, with this advanced new medication we can control epilepsy it's a treatable entity but the duration of treatment is long usually 1 to 2 years of the treatment is required apart from regular consumption of medicine few things which i ask my patient to follow are we ask them to sleep uh, at night for 7 continuous hours sleep deprivation less than 7 hours increases the risk of seizure so with good medication and proper coordination we can defeat epilepsy don't consider epilepsy or seizure as a social stigma don't hide your disease be uh, practical consult your doctor be regular with medication and you can get rid of this condition thank you